need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. If you corrupt your company's data file and need to restore the data from a local backup copy, you can as long as you created local backup copies. You must, however, be in single user mode to do this. When you restore your company file, you overwrite your corrupted company data with the data that you saved when you created the local backup copy. You will then have to re-enter all of the transactions that occurred since the date that you created the backup copy up through the current day to bring your company file back up to date. To restore a corrupted company file from a backup copy, select File from the menu bar, and then choose the Open or Restore Company command. In this situation, you want to restore your data from a backup copy, so select the Restore a Backup Copy option button and then click the Next button to continue. The next window asks where the backup copy that you want to use has been saved. Select the Local Backup Option button if you are using a local backup copy saved to your network or to other removable media, or if you saved the backup copy online using that feature, then select the Online Backup Option button. For this example, we will select the Local Backup option, and once you've made your choice, click the Next button to continue. QuickBooks will next open the Open Backup Copy dialog box. Use this dialog box to navigate to and then select the local backup copy that you want to use for the restore process. Now once you've selected the file to use, click the Open button within the Open Backup Copy dialog box to return to the Open or Restore Company window. Then click the Next button to continue. You will next need to select the file that you wish to overwrite with the selected backup copy. In the Save Company File As dialog box that appears, Navigate to and then select the company file that you want to overwrite with data from your previously selected backup copy. Once you've made your selection, click the Save button to continue. Now if you're overwriting a corrupted company file, QuickBooks may ask you if you wish to overwrite the file. You can click Yes in the message box that appears to overwrite the selected file. Next, QuickBooks cautions you to be absolutely sure that you want to do this by making you type the word yes into the text box within the delete entire file window since you will likely be deleting the most current copy of your company file. You can type the word yes into the box and then click the OK button to begin overwriting the corrupted company file with the data from your selected backup file. Once QuickBooks has successfully restored the company file, it will inform you of that fact in a message box. Just click the OK button to finish. You will then need to re-enter any transactions that were entered into the company file from the time that the backup copy was created up until today to make the company file current once again. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.